Hello and welcome to another daily devotional from Fairview Lutheran Church. As we looked at this week, the festivals of the Old Testament peoples of God and what they were about. And so many of them, we can look at ways which, which they foreshadowed. They, they pointed to the Messiah, to, to Christ and what he would do. His suffering and, and death, his taking our, his sins on his shoulders on the cross as in the Day of Atonement. We look at what the Father did in the harvesting of the, the, the Feast of Weeks or Pentecost. But there's also the idea of knowing their history. And not just for an academic exercise, but knowing their history because in their history, they could clearly see the power of God and they would remember God's work on their behalf. In Leviticus 23, verse 43, this is one of the reasons why God had them celebrate these festivals. So your descendants will know that I had the Israelites live in booths when I brought them out of Egypt. I am the Lord your God. Those festivals were to remind them of what God had accomplished for them. Knowing your history and remembering God's love. Uh, they had to celebrate in booths and in, in tents because for a time they didn't have a tabernacle. They didn't have a, a temple. Uh, we have a house of worship that we have not been able to gather in collectively for some time. Uh, we will be starting with soft openings. And as I drove in this morning, I had a new wonderful reason for why I'm excited about opening up. So that tragedies like what happened to, to George Floyd don't just sit in social media. Don't just play out in, in the news. But there's a place where his family can go and hear about love and be comforted, the church. That there's a place even for those officers who committed that heinous act, which I would consider a crime, to go for repentance. The church is here uh, to represent the God who has given those things to us. And he reaches out in the midst of every tragedy. Whether a natural disaster like a pandemic, God is still there to comfort and to call us to repentance. Or during a tragedy between two human beings because of, because of sin, because of the hatred that's in our hearts that God is there to comfort and offer forgiveness. And so as you look forward to your church reopening, remember why God has us celebrate him. Because he created us, because he loves us, because he forgives us. Let us be like God, loving one another and forgiving one another. Have a blessed day.